Good morning, students. Sai Ram. Today we are going to start with a new chapter in EBS two. Now, as we are going to start a new chapter, I am going to ask you few questions related to your previous chapter. Okay. What knowledge did Shivaji acquire? Yes. Yes, the answer is Shivaji acquired the knowledge of excellent administration and war tactics. Your next question. Why was Jija Bai happy? Why was she happy? Yes, Jija Bai was happy because Shivaji would accomplish her dream of Swaraj. Who got the glimpses of the future? Young Mavlas got the glimpses of the future. So today we are going to learn what compelled Shivaji Maharaj to take the oath of Swaraj in chapter number six, the oath of Swaraj. Now, children, this is part one. As you all know, we are learning all the chapters in parts. So this is part one. We are going to start this part with new words. And you all know what you have to do. Yes, you all have to revise with me. Extraordinary. Extraordinary. E X T R A O R D I N A R Y. Extraordinary. Extraordinary means special flaming flaming p l a y m a t e s flaming flaming means friends companions satisfied satisfied s a t i s F I E D satisfied. Satisfied means contented. Bondman. Bondman. B O N D M E N. Bondman means male slave. Constantly. Constantly. C O N S T A N T L Y constantly. Constantly means always. Destruction. Destruction. D E S T R U C T I O N. Destruction. Destruction means devastation. Or to destroy. Companions. Companions. C O M P A N I O N S. Companions. Companions means friends. Gathered. Gathered. G A T H E R E D gathered. Gathered means to collect or to meet. Thrilled. Thrilled. T H R I L L E D. 
thrilled. Thrill means excited. Anxious. Anxious. A N X I O U S. Anxious means nervous. Bidding. Bidding. B I W E I N G. Bidding means command. Prepared. Prepared. P R E P A R E D. Prepared. Prepared means ready. Children, this is the content outline of this part. We are going to study about the temple at Raireshwar, the fiery eloquence of young Shivaji. Now, children, before explaining in detail, I will explain you in short, a short story. Okay? So be attentive and listen carefully. Now, the temple of Raireshwar. Now, Raireshwar is a name of a temple. To the southwest of Pune, there is a beautiful place called Raireshwar. Now, what is Raireshwar? Yes, it is a temple. Now, which is famous for its Shiva temple. In the year 1645, Shivaji and few Mavlas from the neighboring valley gathered there. Now, why had they come to the spot hidden in the deep forest? Why did they discuss and what favor did they ask of Lord Shiva? Now, in this part, let's study about Shivaji and young Mavlas. Now, fury eloquence means strong speech given by Shivaji Maharaj. Now, what was the effect of that strong speech on young Mavlas? Let us see. Shivaji was quite young, but his mind was busy planning with big things. He spoke to his Mavla friends and the Vatandars what was in his mind. He told them though his father was a Sardar at the court of Bijapur and he had given him the charge of Pune where everything was going on peacefully but he was not happy. He was still unhappy because of the constant attack by foreign kingdoms because of which the soldiers die leaving their families orphans. He asked them how long should we be a slave of the Sultan and work for him only for the small Watan given by a Sultan. Shivaji's face was red with anger when he was giving a speech. He looked at his companions. Now companions means friends. He looked at his friends who were in the inner sanctum of Raireshwar. Now friends were inside the temple and even Shivaji was inside the temple. When they were taking blessings of Lord Shiva. Shivaji was giving speech to young Mavlas. Now they told Shivaji that they are with him. And whatever he did even at the cost of their lives. Means they were ready to give their lives. Now let us study in detail. Children, this is the content outline of this part. We are going to study about the temple at Raireshwar, the fiery eloquence of young Shivaji. 
Now children, the picture you can see on the screen is the temple of Raiveshwar. Now where this temple is situated? Yes, this temple is situated to the south of Pune. It is a beautiful spot and it is called Raiveshwar. Now it is famous for its temple and it is of Lord Shiv. In the year 1645, an extraordinary event took place over there. Shivaji and few Mavlas from the neighboring valley had gathered there. Now why they had come over there to this lovely spot hidden in the deep forest? What they discussed among themselves? What favor did they ask from Lord Shiv? Let us study in this part. The fury eloquence of young Shivaji. Now what do you mean by fury eloquence? It means a strong speech. Now it was given by Shivaji. Shivaji was still quite young. But his mind was already busy planning big things. Yes, his mind was planning big things. He opened his mind to his friends and said, Now as whatever is there in your mind, you are always open in front of your friends, parents, grandparents. So even Shivaji did the same. He opened his mind in front of his friends. He said, My dear friends, today I am going to talk to you about something which is in my mind for a long time. My father Shahaji Raje is a Sardar at the court of Bijapur. It is he who has given me the charge of this Jagir. Everything is going on well and peacefully. But friends, I am not happy. Must we always remain satisfied as bondmen of the Sultan? Bondman means slave. Must we always remain slave of the Sultan? Must we always eat out of other people's hand? We are surrounded on all sides by foreign kingdoms which are constantly at war. Now at that time everybody was fighting for some or the other thing. And many people were killed. Now when you fight soldiers are there in the war and they get killed families get uprooted all of them suffers this destruction and what we get out of it he said he asked what we get out of it nothing but slavery now slave remains the work we do for our sultans now how long shall we continue to tolerate this? How long for how long we are going to do this the same thing? How long shall we lay down our lives for others? Shall we allow this to continue just for the sake of a small vatan? For a small vatan we are killing many people? What have you to say all this? So Shivaji was asking his friends about their opinion. So what have you to say all this? Now I have opened my mind. What is your opinion? He asked. Now Shivaji, when Shivaji was speaking, his with Shivaji was speaking with great emotions and his face was red with anger. In the middle of this speech he stopped and looked at his friends. The young Mavlas gathered in the inner sanctum of Raireshwar temple. They were inside the temple and they were greatly thrilled by Shivaji's speech. They had seen a new vision. One of them said, now one of the Mavlas said, one of the friends said, Our young prince, tell us clearly whatever is in your mind. So whatever is, is in your mind, speak up. We are ready to do whatever you 
still now we are prepared we are anxious to do your bidding bidding means command whatever you command us we are ready to do the other said yes raji they all said they all said in one voice yes raji we are with you whatever you say at the cost of our lives if our lives are needed we are ready to give our lives children we will do a quick recap of this part shivaji was young but his mind was planning big things he told his friends about what is in his mind for a long time shahaji raje a sardar at the court of bijapur gave shivaji charge of the jagir but shivaji was not happy as bondman of sultan the maratha soldiers were at war got killed and families get uprooted just for a small watan inspired by shivaji's speech at the sanctum of raideshwar his friends were ready to give the lives for swaraj children we will start with our assessment fill in the blanks by choosing the correct option to the southwest of pune the dash temple was a beautiful spot raheshwar mahakali ship yes which one is the correct option and the correct option is shiv temple second one dash was speaking with great emotion and his face was red with anger options are shahaji raje shivaji deshmukh and the correct option is shivaji who said to whom select the correct option now who said these words to whom my father shahaji raje is a sardar at the court of bijapur now who said these words shivaji said to his companions and the other option is shivaji said to his father and the correct option is shivaji said to his companions first one tell us clearly what is in your mind shivaji said to one of the companion and the other option is one of the companion said to shivaji and the correct answer is second one one of the companion said to shivaji we are with you we shall do whatever you say at the cost of our lives if need be young mavlas said with one voice to shivaji maharaj young mavlas said with one voice to shahaji raj and the correct option is young mavlas said with one voice to shivaji maharaj first one state whether the following statements are true or false first one shivaji took the oath of swaraj in 1564 the statement is true or false now this statement is false shivaji always wanted to be a bondman of the sultan true or false and the statement is false the young mavlas gathered there in the inner sanctum of raideshwar were greatly thrilled by shivaji's speech and the statement is yes very good the statement is true children what you all are going to do yes you are going to revise all new words you are going to write it three times and you have to 
submit your assignment right thank you